All right, guys, on today's video, I'm going to be showing you how you install the PSNES emulator on the Nintendo Switch. Now, what this is going to allow you to do is to play the Super Nintendo games. I'm going to be leaving you all the links that you're going to need in the pinned comment of the video. So the first link is going to be for my page. So just scroll down on the page until you find the wallpaper of the video. There's going to be one link, which is going to be for the PSNES emulator download page over on the Homebrew App Store. Now you're going to need to create a PSNES folder with the NRO. Then you're going to need to create a ROMs folder with your games. Now the games can be in .zip, .bin, .smc, or .sfc formats. Um, I cannot provide you any links to games. You must obtain these on your own. So now just copy the whole Switch folder to the root of your Nintendo Switch SD card with all the PCNES contents. So now over on the Homebrew App Store. So this is going to be the PCNES emulator download page. So this is going to be the latest version of 6.7.1. You're going to go over to the download section. You're going to download the file. Now this is going to be a zip folder. You're going to need to unzip it using 7-Zip or WinRAR. So now this is going to be the PCNES folder. So this is going to have a Switch folder. A PCNES folder. Now this is going to have the PCNES.nro file. So inside this folder, uh, you must create a ROMs folder with your games. And then just copy the whole Switch folder onto the root of your Nintendo uh, Switch's SD card. So that's basically it on the computer. Now we're going to get over on the Nintendo Switch. Um, I'll show you guys how to set up the emulator uh, with the best settings and a little bit of gameplay. Alright guys, now over on the Switch... Uh, first thing we're going to do is we are going to check if the NRO was installed. So we are going to go into the album. You are going to scroll over. So we do have the uh, PCNES emulator, the NRO. Uh, now we're going to hit the home button. Now I recommend um, running these emulators in uh, full RAM mode. So to do that. You're going to hold the R button while loading up an official application or a game. So just like that. There you go. Now the switch is running in full RAM mode. Now we're going to start the emulator. You're going to hit the A button. So this is going to be a really simple emulator. Um, if you want to bring up the um, settings, just hit the plus button. Uh, so you're going to be able to change uh, the aspect ratio to 16 by 9. Uh, scaling, full. Which is going to give you the full screen. Uh, you can show FPS. And then you can re uh, remap your buttons, uh, buttons if you want. Now B to go back. Now it's going to show you the uh, game list on the left hand side. Uh, now the white ones are going to be the ones that you guys are going to add. So the ones in red are just the list. So I'm just going to load up a game quickly, show you a little bit of gameplay. So the game I added was Castlevania Dracula X. So press A to load it. Now it's showing uh, 60 frames per second. Uh, 
Um, if you want to bring up the menu to save the game, just hit the uh, minus and plus button at the same time. Uh, you're going to scroll all the way down until you see the states section. You're going to hit it with A. So this is going to load your saves. Now go back. So you shouldn't have any problems with any of the games. Um, it should be able to play the whole library. Let's pause it. Now to exit out, hit the minus and plus, and then go all the way down, uh, quick game takes you back then you hit the home button and then we'll close it out so that is how you install the uh, peace nest emulator on the nintendo switch i hope you guys enjoyed the video please like comment and subscribe and on to the next one